Okay, um, so here's here's the third video on this uh, brushless motor rewinding fiasco. Here's here's your uh, here's my three parallel wires. I tried to measure off. Shit. I tried to measure off enough to get you know ten winds on three of these poles. And, and and not run out of wire, so I'd have to solder it between poles. You know what I mean, I think. Um, so I'm gonna start these. See these these three wires. I'm gonna make. Boy, that's not even a good zoom. I'm gonna make this the in. So I'm just gonna stick it in this hole, so it doesn't get twisted or tangled. If I could actually get this in the hole, there you go. And now I'm going to bend it over and I'm blocking everything and see, here it is. And now I'm going to just pick any pole, I got my three wires, and I'm going to just start to wind, trying to keep everything, um, trying to keep all the wires from not twisting around each other in line, you know, so that they don't, so I can get more wire on the pole. Okay, so now I'm going to wind. I'm going to go 10 times if I can. Let's see. Here's one. I find it's easier if you just not actually roll the wire with your hand, but roll the, rotate the um, motor. It's the uh, stator. No, this isn't the stator. Whatever. The, whatever this is. Rotate this instead of twisting the wire. Okay, so I got, what do I have? I'm a, this is number two. I got one. I'm on two now. Jeez. See? See how I'm trying to get that wire from staying nice and even. I got number, I got, what? what is that? That's one, two, that's three. You know, I lost track of how many times I wound this, but you see what I'm doing basically. I'm just twisting this and winding this. So let me finish getting this as many times as I can, and I'll jump to the next pole. So I'm